Hello everybody, welcome back to another American Truck Simulator episode. Today, we are going to head to Wolf Point with um, radioactive material, 50,926 pounds of radioactive materials, and the Kenworth W990. It has a Cummins X15. Uh, 565 horsepower with the Eaton Fuller 18 speed with the 355 ratio. Um, we got a what, uh, five axle low boy and uh, 1142 miles to go. So uh, let's get this trip started, shall we? We'll jump inside. Go ahead and get the crap off the screen. There we go. Put the key on. Make sure it's in neutral. Yep. Go ahead and push the clutch in. Start it up. Light the clutch out slowly. There we are. Yep, she's running. We got a little bit over half tank of fuel, so we're we'll probably gonna have to fill up at some point. Um we have 218 gallons we can go a thousand one thousand miles but yeah definitely gonna have to fill up um, we should only have to fill up once we have 4,436 miles on this truck already it's turned out to be a pretty damn good truck I've uh I'm beginning to like it we're going to be on version 1.40 of the game. We've got Project Next Gen's graphic mods and skybox. Along with reshade with the realistic photo settings just to make everything look a little bit better. Yeah, and that's it. Well, let me make sure I got my traffic set here. We want three. There we go. Our traffic is set. There's going to be quite a bit of traffic. Just to make it a little bit more interesting. Um, let's go. Um, clutch in. Break off. Let's go ahead and uh, we'll see if we can start off in the first low here. I'm using a Logitech G920 racing wheel with the um, driving force shifter from Logitech. I've had this for three days now and uh, I love it. Buying me a Eaton Fuller 18 speed shifter knob with the split and the range on it. I'm also going to invest in some uh, track IR, which is head tracking, so I can turn my head in and actually look around the truck without having to push any buttons or anything. That'll be nice. Three might have been a bit too much traffic, actually. I don't know. We'll find out here. We might have to change it back down to two instead of three. But we got quite a little trip ahead of us. I'm not sure how long it's going to take us to get there in real life time, but I guess we'll find out. This is one of the longer trips that I've 
done a video on. Got our lights on. It's 9, almost 10 a.m. We can go ahead and turn our lights off. We don't have to have those on anymore. Sure, keep good following distance. We don't want to run into anything or risk breaking this nuclear material, radioactive materials open. Um, could create a mess. Speed limit is 55. We got this double in front of us, which is going to slow us down a bunch. I don't know why they go so damn slow, but they do. If I knew how to change that, I would. I mean, look at this 25 mile an hour on a little B hill. Of course, you'd have to be turning to. Yeah, that's about right. Um, down in the fourth here. And of course they don't know how to yield. Seems legit. Yeah, just pull right out there in front of the state trooper. Highway patrol. We are floating the gears. perfect driver so my shifting could possibly be off a little bit still getting used to the gear shift and everything the way the game runs so how's everybody been doing out there in the YouTube land <laughs> been doing pretty good I done eating me a big old meal. I thought, man, I need to relax now. I said, jump on here and do a little bit of American Truck Simulator. I found this load and I thought, oh, what the hell, why don't we just record it? So, that's how we ended up where we're at right at the moment. Shift real fast. When you 
pull it out of gear, pause for a second or two, and then drop it back down in the next gear. Get the RPM, it's time to drop back down. That's the key. You gotta know when to shift. When those RPMs hit a certain level to shift, when they drop down far enough where you can downshift. Stiff. Looks like they got the roadblock for some reason. Come on, car, go. I mean, shit, he stopped and let you out, and you're just gonna sit there. Yeah, put your four ways on. Retard. That little truck's gonna let us out. Thank you, buddy. Let them know we appreciate it. You don't want to shift too fast, but you don't want to shift too slow either. There's a happy medium there. Seven high to eight low. That's just you gotta let the RPMs drop just a little bit. Not as much as you're going from seven low to eight low. See anything falling off the trailer? There's no trail of green goo shooting out. Must be alright. Been putting a high. We're cruising now. This is uh, what, 78,000 pounds? Is that what I said it was? 50,000 pounds. 50,000 pounds of radioactive material. A lot of uh, radioactive material. Seventy-five. Twenty-three more miles will be in Wales. Here's one thing. This could, I don't know what it is about the steering wheel, but uh, when you force feedbacks, you know, makes it shake with the engine. And if you're turning it just right, it got some fucking rattle to it. It's just driving me crazy. Like there's something loose. It's 
I didn't tighten the screw up or something. This is bugging the hell out of me. Don't forget we gotta stop and get fuel at some point. Don't wanna let it get too low and risk the chance of running out or being stuck out in the middle of nowhere. That would not be fun. Those clouds are getting it up there, aren't they? Back it down. seven low hit that split button again get ready for seven high rpms hit up there let off the fuel shift from the seven high we'll go ahead and hit the split button again so when we drop it down it'll drop an eight low there we go just like i nailed it that time Pulled over there on the side of the road. You son of a bitch. Who the hell does that? Fucking stops right next to a cop on his damn interstate. Especially with the truck hauling radioactive material behind you. That's just retarded. That's something they'd do in real life, that's for damn sure. Go ahead and put an eight high. Save a little bit of fuel if we can. More money in our pocket at the end of the day. It'd be cool if they had force feedback for the gear shift. We can feel it vibrating and grinding. That'd be pretty neat. Probably make some money there. Hold on, where's my dog at? He's still in here. Dogs are out there fighting outside. Make sure my little dog was still in here. Go out there and kick him upside the head. Put a boot to them. The only way they fucking listen. They attacked the damn goat here the other day. Tried to kill it. Healthcare center. Five 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 seven 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 eight six seven zero. Oh. I don't know what the rest of the number was. Yeah, looks like we've got a pre-pass. Green or red? Red. Of course it's red. It's always red. Look at those RPM drop to about 10. Finding a new Grab her up. Put it in first slow. Come on, North American Mining Quarries. Let's go. Mines and quarries. My bad. Oh, it's got Jake break on, huh? Yeah. Seven thousand pounds. What we got up 
up here. Driver, let's go. How oh, is he even doing up there? <clears throat> oh, hey, trailer up there. fell through the fucking ground again. I don't know why the doubles do that, but they do. Oh jeez, up that way. I don't know that we can fit through here. We're gonna give it a try though. Take it nice and slow. Plenty of room, plenty of room. Nope, here trying to figure out what life is. Goddamn forward air, should have known. Forward air, got old fucking some kind of car there. Then we got the hay hole. Be 
almost 85, that's alright, we're not even doing 70. Do got a half tank of fuel, so we're still good there. What time is it? It's almost 4 p.m. Alright, we don't have to kill the lights on. Turn the lights on. Until about 5.36. Looks like we're going to be driving all night in our ETAs for 7 a.m. No big deal, we got good lights on the truck. Nice blue underglow. Speed limit 70, I'm doing 68, and a little red car just passed us, like we say, it's still. There's gonna must be Salt Lake City here, you know. Keep right, and then exit Salt Lake City in a way. Hands on the wheel, not on the phone. Can't pull on that one, driver. I hear you. Riversdale Road. So traffic's gonna be picking up. We'll get out of this damn city. Work is too bad. All trucks use the right lane and pre-pass. Steering wheel for my steering wheel. Kind of 
kind of sounded weird, but yeah.
took me a while to get the right balance of textures and shit like that. We cut this off and slow down and stop in front of us. Now he's gonna get back over. What a jackass. Stop and get some fuel and a drink. Next truck stop we come to. My whistle's a little dry. <laughs> the clouds, it's pretty nice. Looks like it could rain over there. Area. Yeah, I'm gonna stop at a gas station or a truck stop though. Can't get fuel at a rest area. Well, I mean, you can't even siphon it out of somebody else's thing, but why the hell would you do that for? keep a little lock cap on my tail. Never know, I've seen people pull up beside trucks and just run a hose straight over the little pump. Dude sleeping doesn't even know it. Let's see, lights are on. There. They usually do it to company drivers. Like a lot of company can afford it. <laughs> Wonder how the hell you explain that to the DM driver made full tank when I went to sleep, so woke up and there was nothing. It's empty. Need, need more fuel. <laughs> That'd suck. Keep left. Keep left, she said. hard on that one, that would have locked it up. Uh, can't get over. We gotta get around this fucking bus. Put your blinker on, then they all slow down. Bullshit. I hit that fucking gear. Dude, this shit's stupid.
this thing stupidly on me, underpowered. gear. Fuck you and your weight station. I ain't turning all the way down there just to go to the fucking weight station. That's stupid. some fucking engine mods in this goddamn truck. there. Definitely going to start to get fuel at the next station we come to. fucking me up. Seven gallons left. Says we can go another 387 miles. Surely there's gonna be a gas station or a truck stop between here and 300 miles.
It's like I keep hitting the brakes for her. shit and fucking outside views so we can't stay in that very long I can barely drive as it is let's bungle in the chapel be a double that truck right up there engine brakes off yep you fucking asshole you better go bitch got a big gas station coming up. Preferably do not want to go have to drive all the way downtown in some fucking city. Do what you gotta do sometimes, I guess.
no shit. station down there too. There he is. A little late now, Donnie. And dumb past it. Fucking bullshit. <sighs> Vehicle crash into what? Where? Cause you rear-ended me and I got the fucking... Okay. That makes a lot of sense. I guess we gotta go here to f fucking fuel. Can't even put a damn. Can't even put a waypoint there. What kind of shit is that? There it is. Oh, you just can't do it while you're zoomed in that far. That fucking retarded. rear into me and I get the damn ticket for it. I don't know what kind of crack you've been smoking game, but sure. Shut up! Come on over there.
Make a user. Oh, shut up. Can't even see where a road or anything is. Shit ass place is this. Whatever. It is what it is. Stay right here until morning. Alright, got our belly full, got our tanks full, took a leak. We're good to go for a while. Let's get out of here. If we can. Took a little nap. It was five, almost five thirty in the morning. I thought this was a gas station, but it's, it's somebody's, somebody's uh, barn. Turn right. Yes, ma'am. Make sure there ain't nothing coming first. should be coming up here soon. Let's go play a little bit of multiplayer uh, Zero Truck Simulator 2, but we kept getting disconnected, so I gave up on it. First, there ain't nothing coming. Turn right. Let's get this nuclear uh, waste delivered and radioactive waste delivered off our trailer. else can deal with it. I should have fixed the truck while I was there. Whatever. Missouri River. Thought we was in Montana. Now we're back up to 
cruising speed. You know, full tank of fuel, we don't have to worry about that. We should have plenty to finish the trip off. The little car just cut us off. No blink or nothing. Big limit 70 miles an hour. Doing 69. Lights are on still. Wait until about 8.30, 9 o'clock and we'll cut the lights off. That way we won't get no ticket. Great Falls. Where was we going to? I don't forget. What point? Hmm. Got 300 and so miles. About three quarters of the way there. Force feedback with the shifter would be pretty cool. Feel the gears grinding. <laughs> if I knew how to make something like that, I bet you could make some money off of it. Tesla dealer flipped the bird. Keep right and then continue straight on. Go straight on. Well, the brake pedal's getting easier to push down. I 
pass. And then continue straight on. Go straight on. Then whip it over there. Go ahead and hit save eighth loop. Save that fuel. at the end of the day. Thing to add into the game, make it more realistic. Probably have a lot more rigs, so. I didn't really like it. No, I like it. Kind of grows on you a little bit. Brake clutch, glass clutch, brake clutch, gas clutch. Clutch it in, clutch it out. The shift and dance. That's the way they taught us in school. Brake, clutch, gas, clutch. They had us do that with our feet as we sit down. They called it the shift and dance. I could use a little bit more power to it. Definitely. Well, you can tell we're not on the uh, SCS map anymore. map would be so much better if they just take a little bit extra time for the details. But Big Motel. Twenty four tower tire service. Was it a motel or a workshop? strip club trading post
Let's all go down for the dudes block here. Speed comes in handy. Why do you shove it in reverse? It dies on you. shifting.
platform. Got a good steering wheel and shifter and stuff. Just motion platform and a VR headset. That'd be it right there. I'd be playing it 24-7. Hills coming up. You're wound up. Maybe we can make it up. Oh yeah. Not one but two harvesters. They're all just standing out there talking. in our transport. Where's that K in R? Gotta be H and R, huh? What's your load suspension gauge set there? 110, 25. Don't remember what our weight was. 87,000 pounds. Oh no, he's almost out of fuel too, so. Put it in one low. Good we'll build take off in that. Damn light ever changes. Engine break off. Oh, my shifter came off the table. shift comes off. We had a car like that once. Better reach down off in the transmission and change gears. There's a, something else.
Little truck stop there, wasn't there? I don't believe we would have made it this far. Just did not have enough fuel. Getting closer. 98 more miles to go. And we got a freaking double up there in front of us. Never fails. Another thing I wish they'd fix the way the damn doubles work. Anything that's holding more than one trailer, even if it's the low boys, with the dolly on it, fucking slow. 25. Combine harvesters, 25. I can understand those, but really? They got it in there, little fucking Honda. And come on. That and the damn merging. They just teach the AI how to merge. Oh, there's another hill. They're dropping back down to third. Because they got doubles doesn't mean they got that much more fucking weight. It doesn't work like that. Whoever scripted the damn AI thinks it does, though. Get ready to turn left. He better not be turning. I'm gonna have a shit fit. cookies.
Now we're getting somewhere. Bam, we gotta turn again. Get ready to turn right. Turn right. Goddamn dirt road, really? Shake that nuclear, uh, the radioactive material up. But they clunk together and rub each other and do one of them kinds of nasty shit that it's doing. Trying to run right, right in front of it. He tried to run right to the side of my trailer. My means having a mini stroke. I blame it on Swift. Down. 
to stop, look and listen. Don't shift gears when you're going across the track. Flashers off. Put a blinker on. The bug complained about it. God, look at that line of traffic. I can give a shit less than the truth. Get some open up the damn floodgate, didn't they? Is, but apparently they wanted a radioactive material here. Anything coming? Don't hear anything. My window is not down all the way. Five miles, 30 hours, 15 minutes, 299 gallons of fuel burn, 5,535,276. Damn. Four day, about two day run. That's fucking great. Level 133, Divine Champion. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and comment down below. Have a wonderful day, and we'll see you in the next video.